My name is Linda Hardman. I work at CWI, the Dutch National Centre for Mathematics and Computer Science. I'm a manager of research and strategy, and I'm also a professor at Utrecht University one day a week. My field of research is basically about human-computer interaction. I'm specifically interested in how people interact with information, and currently I'm looking at how we can use augmented reality to improve that for specifically neuroscientists. So we went on holiday to China in 2017, and indeed I realised that my view of China as an average citizen in the Netherlands was just totally skewed with the reality in China at the moment. And afterwards there was a very nice opportunity to represent my own institute, CWI, and also the French sister institute, INRIA, in a collaboration between, in Beijing, the Chinese Academy of Sciences and uh, our European counterparts. So I'm very interested in how we initiate research collaborations and my role was to go to Beijing and to learn more about the researchers over there and to find certain collaborations across the, the two continents, visiting different institutes in Beijing and understanding the work that was going on there and communicating that back to researchers in here at CWI but also in France. The notion of competition with Chinese big tech companies was seen as a threat and I think there was too much paranoia in the Western press about the dangers of taking on Chinese technology. Now that's my personal opinion. All disciplines need to learn more about how China works, uh, what the status of Chinese research and there tends to be an uninformed reaction to people who haven't had a lot of exposure to, to China, to Chinese researchers, to Chinese people. And I think that's unfortunate. Chinese researchers are doing excellent work. Um, and I was privileged to be in the review panel for the computer science departments at the universities in Hong Kong a couple of years ago. And it was really fascinating to see that, you know, these universities are in, in the world's top universities in computer science and AI. So in academic research, it's always very important to have collaborators because thinking on your own is just not good enough. Across the world, we have different research cultures, we have different research expertises. And certainly the Chinese expertise in computer science and artificial intelligence, or AI, has been growing amazingly in the last 10 years or so. It's the Chinese research which is speeding ahead at an amazing rate. And, you know, I think Collaborating, getting different ideas from different cultures, different contexts, different ways of thinking. Diversity really is just very valuable in academic research, be that uh, you know, gender-based, ethnicity-based or uh, culture-based. It's, it's just valuable having diversity in the way we think.